Hi guys, welcome back to a brand new video and today I'm here at the Legoland Windsor Resort for my third visit of the 2022 season. Now it's very very hot today um, and the heat is also a reason why we actually left Kessingham Beach one day early because there's no really where really to get away from it when you're camping. At least here at Legoland we've gone into the hotel and we're sitting there for a bit just waiting for it to cool down because the queue's along as well. It's just so so hot. So I thought I'd keep filming. I'll come outside for five minutes and just get used to the heat, not get used to the cold, otherwise it'll be a lot for me, but it's still really, really hot. Oh, some shade here. Um, but yeah, we've done two rides, Dragon and Pirate Falls. We queued 35 minutes for Pirate Falls and about 25 for Dragon. But that's good. The queues are calming down a bit, but everyone seems to be sort of leaving. So. But oh, I'm not a heat fan either. Probably get into the Castle Hotel in a minute. So I mean, you don't know what the um, you don't know what the sort of what almost rules are with the hotel. But also kind of almost nervous that we're just going to get locked out of the park into the hotel so you don't really want that what have we got oh yeah so we've sort of done knight's kingdom we might go back and do dragon's apprentice what pretty sure we're going to do um the viking river splash although i'm not I'm not queuing a long time for that because it's a short ride um it's just all long queues and and that is just, I don't see it worth it queuing. I think Drenched Towers are definitely one that I'll probably check out. Um, yeah. Uh, right, I think Drenched Towers seems like maybe we'll head to Drenched Towers and just stay there. Because I'm pretty sure that's what I want to do. Yeah, I'm, it's so hot. But I think maybe we just had to drench towers. But yeah. Well, what we was going to be doing loads of rides, but it's just so hot. I mean, maybe it was a bit of a stupid decision this morning to come out to a park where it's hotter than to go somewhere more quiet. But oh well, we're here. It didn't take long to get here. We have been here for two hours now. Actually, no, we got here at 20 past 12. And now it's like, oh, to mention, we've only got two hours of the day left here at Legoland. So I like how near it is to Mythica, how open it is. It's almost like having a big playground. The only catch to the playground is that you melt. I thought there was a shop here, but it turns out I can't find it. And I think it's on the other side, which you can't get to. It's a bit confusing because reception's not this side for this hotel. So if you want to go, I have no idea how you get to it. The only way I think you possibly could is on any what elevators up. If you go on an elevator up to your room and then you cross uh, on an upper level, the only way I can think you could do it. It's so hot. Maybe what I'm thinking is I'm just going to run over and do some Mythica rides just because we have driven 80 miles, like nearly 80 miles to get down here. But yeah, so sorry about that. I'm head inside the hotel now. So this is the Legoland Windsor Resort Hotel. This is the normal one some great theming in here but that, that's the shop I think they're like take a look around it's quite cool isn't it the bricks now, just for your information the freestyle vessels are 15 pounds they're 15 pounds so you get all of this I think that's free unlimited it has to be at 15 quid This is what I mean. So we are on the ground. No, we're not. Oh, I get what's wrong. We aren't in the hotel, really. 
Oh, we are. Oh, that's really confusing. Oh, restaurant bar and pot. Oh, so technically, we're, oh, we're on level two. Aha. Uh -huh. So we have to go down a level to get there. That's quite nice. I do see what I do like. But uh, I'm very confused because if you can just walk into reception downstairs and then get the elevator up here, walk straight into the park, not costing you a penny. But there's got to be a catch. Anyway, I head this way now. And yeah, I'll see you when we do so. Right, so hello then, guys. Yeah, so I've left the hotel for a minute. It's so hot, it's just getting hotter. And the problem is, yeah, I don't think it was the smartest choice to drive to Legoland today, but it was the problem is it was early, quite early, uh, where we was, and it was cloudy and with and with that we were just thinking, oh it'll be alright, we'll cover up. Cause we got sunburned like like hell yeah yesterday. We got properly sunburned. Hoping they don't shut these gates, I'm a bit stuffed if they do. So I can vault over a fence. Um, walking up into Mythica, currently. Beastly bites. Just try and get a bit of footage for you if don't go any rides. I've got to stay in shape. Magical forest, we'll go for a walk through here. This is new for this year. Light tunnel opened such a short time ago. I love this. This is one of my favourite walkthroughs ever. A bit plain there. Got bits and bobs here. I'm sure, this pretty the same. It's very good. I think what we'll probably do is at ten to six, just jump in queue for Skyline because I, the journey is worth it. If I go on Skyline, I love that ride. It's one of the best rides ever. my third favourite ride beyond Wicker Man and Swall. So it even ranks high against coasters. Against rides other than coasters, it's number one. So the problem is, we've got, we've got some things to do with family in that tomorrow, so it's like, I really don't want to be feeling rough, because yeah, I've spent so much time in the sun, today that sunstroke um i'm really not that good with sun i get sunstroke quite easily well not sunstroke but i just feel rough for the next couple of, for the next day and really rough and it's not nice i don't it's not sunstroke but it's just makes me feel horrible what's that it's like a lego bat it's nice lava oh it's water oh Never wanted that so much. I think this is towards the end of the attraction now. We have some lovely screens. See, a couple of week a couple of months ago we came just for this week it opened. And that was a good visit because it was only it was the hottest day of the year so far then. But that wasn't very hot. And that was the walkthrough. I hope you guys enjoyed that little walkthrough. See, I've already got some footage. What is Skyline on? This is a bit of a shortcut, actually. I'm sure it is. Um, hour, no. Well, no, I'm not doing it anyway. Cause for a minute, 20 minutes. Oh, I want to do that. It's not 20 minutes. 
think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back, I'm going to have 10 more minutes out of the sun, and I'm going to get back to it. Look at the queue for that. This is my first ever Legoland vlog. I thought there's not going to be much vlogging footage, really. I've learned how to make longer vlogs, not more entertaining ones, just longer ones. Get some off-rider this. So, personally, Lego Mythica is my favourite themed land. And the idea of sitting in it on a table down by it for a while, I do not oppose to. I'm, I'm perfectly happy, really, just to be here and have a look at it. But, right, Hydra's Challenge. See, the thing about Hydra's Challenge, I don't really want to queue 60 minutes. Just because I know it will be 60. I'm not seeing it lower than 60, otherwise I would have done it. I'm desperate to do it. Maybe at 10 to 6. I think all we're doing today, I don't think we're going to go any further than Mythica. Maybe just do all the rides in Mythica. Uh, there's only one new ride. But that's alright. Beware, dinosaurs ahead. Right, thank God, I'm back in the hotel bit now. See, that's what I don't like inter interchanging between them. But yeah, with plenty of fluids. Lovely fountains here. Might head down to the shop, although I don't want to get like. See, the thing is, I kind of want to save all the hotel stuff downstairs for like when we stay. Because I remember talking about staying there for my birthday in December because it's open. And it's like, it seems that be, it'll be a good enough time in there and then obviously I can get as much of a walk around the park as possible. Or maybe we'll come the weekend of my birthday so selected rides are open. But yeah. What we'll do now, we're going to walk back into the hotel and I'll just show you what it's like to walk in. there but yeah it's like lounge area it's very nice it's not soft play I thought it was what's this oh my god that's so expensive skyline bar yeah right, I'll end this clip here so I'm back in Lego Mythica now. I think this is basically just going to be a Lego Hotel and Mythica vlog. I might just call it that, not a full vlog. Although I am now walking into Heart Lake City just for the loo. But um, yeah, we're going to go on that as long as it's not a long queue. Because I'm not doing more than 10 minutes. It's so hot. Oh, it is boiling. I know, if you're in the UK right now, this is Saturday the 9th of July. And I know we're British, we moan about the weather. This is weather deserves to be moaned about. Because, <laughs> yeah, originally, if you, um, we was meant to be at Pleasurewood Hills today in Lowestoft. We was going to do that. We hadn't booked it, because if we had, we'd have ended up driving up there today. Um, Can't do that no. one, we have to come another time. It says 20. I know it can't be really. That's not 20. I queued from the entrance, it was only 30. Right. Find the bathroom. Very American. I feel cute for that. And I think we're just going to chill for a bit, have a drink. Um, I'll probably maybe check out the shop. And then we'll queue for Skyline and get, get out of here. Because. At the end of the day, I've got to almost think if we end up finishing here at Legoland, I mean, it is worth just. It's, it's nice in the hotel, you know? So it is worth it if we end up. So I do wish Smith had some toilets in it, to be honest. If you look at benefit from toilets, 
Um, there's a lot of people. Oh my god! Got a show here. There's some show footage for you all, hopefully. What I do like about Legoland is this small park. Um, well, I say small park. It's a big park, but it's small enough to get to. This must be a thousand people. All I can see is heads. What's that? The divers. Show that was awesome. Right, so we've got to escape the crowd. Oh, I've got to see the myth cassette. Oh, I've wanted this forever. 50, oh, I can't do 55 quid on it. 45, sorry. Coming in really quick. I think I asked for this essentially. When I went to Skyline back in December, I said. I kill before a Lego Mythica set, just of Maximus. They have come through. No, I didn't. It's weird. I, I mean, it was inevitable. But the success of Mythica. Obviously, this was thought up in two years. The whole area, and it's the best area I've ever been in. I mean, it's better than X Sector, Dark Forest, Forbidden Valley, Amity Beach, at Thorpe Park. <laughs> They're not really well themed. It also beats all the themed areas here. And also, I've been a Lego fan, like a in Lego enthusiast, for about five, well, ever since I was young. I've been really into it for the past three or four years. So, the fact that it's my two favourite things in one is incredible. I bet you this queue's got longer now. I swear, if this is a long queue, good it's not. So, queue up. Hang on, it might be 20 minutes. I thought this was going to be a walk-on ride. See, it should load up quite nicely. I'll see you if I end up riding. And I know it seems like I've got a short patience, but it's hot, hot and hot. Oh, it like I'll be riding. Come here a minute. Oh my god. Roasting in the queue for this it may actually be 20 minutes. Maybe hang about see if we get queued forward. Hey girls, we're back here. I'm leaving the queue like I worked out. It's about four rides. Bang in mind, I did this not too long ago, and it wasn't really much for me. I know it's not meant to be, but 20 minutes is not that. It's probably more 15. But I like that they're advertising it as that. But they are slow. the operations on this are a bit slow. And oh, I'm not bothered. Really. It's, it's alright if it's a walk on, but you don't get walk ons at Legoland. It doesn't happen. Um, there's a slide credit. 
Should we do the slide credit? Then I'm going to go back to the hotel. And I think all we'll do now, not much more. Is there a queue? Like there's not a queue. There better not be a queue. I can't queue. There's a queue on coming off. Right. Actually, that looks like a good slide. That is Lava Dragon Play. I mean, it's a... It's, to be honest, it's not like a play park, is it? To be fair, no climbing or standing. Yeah, okay, that's fair enough. One person at a time in a forward seated position. No. You are telling people to exactly what to do on it. You're making it an attraction. You need to have it manned. Which, yes, it is manned. There is someone there. Play, breaking up playground fights, I guess. Right, I'm going to head back into the hotel, gonna have a drink, sit down for a bit, and then we'll probably, no, I might spend my hour queuing for that ride. Just, I don't know. So maybe we'll get time to do both. If we do them two at the start, maybe we'll do Deep Sea Adventure as well. If I do them three, I'll be happy with the day, because it's, like, I've got a bit of footage for you guys. It's because... And when it does get hot and you're sitting inside, you start to think, oh, is this a waste of a day? Because like, it's, it's hard to understand if it's worth it. This is wor worth it, definitely, 100%. But, um, yeah, I'll see you when I'm in there. about to die so if I do turn the camera off quickly you know why um, you might not even actually see this clip so it's quite special if you do get to put Minecraft dungeons in here. I'm gonna walk outside and talk about my plan. There is a plan of action kind of so I'm not gonna head out of the thing this bit again. But yeah so ride close is at 6 pm today. I say ride close I mean um, Park closed, and that's queue closed. Now all rides have got hour plus queues, and it's too hot really to queue in them. So my aim is, is to maybe do a couple of tiny rides in Mythica or around that area, and then head to an hour queue ride, or a major ride, hopefully not an hour queue ride, and do it, because What's, the, what's wrong with doing an hour queue ride? Yeah. So, I'll see you when we put that plan in structure. It might not happen. You're right, so I'm in the queue for um, the drop tower, but yeah, I'm going to be on next. Then we're going to head to the shop, but the vlog might end here, but if it does, thank you guys for watching, or there might be the shop.